guys, FLW Tour Pro Jacob Wheeler here, and today we're talking about you know big swim bait and swim bait rods, and and you know what's really important also is setting your reels for these big swim baits. Right here, I have one of my favorite reels for throwing a big swim bait. It's the Komodo 350, and I'm gonna explain to you real quick here how to adjust the braking system on this reel. First off, we have a, a screw side plate that basically the screw connects to the other side of the reel, and it's on the right side, and you're gonna make three or four rotations and it's just gonna pop out a little bit. You'll see it pop out. Now, instead of like a lot of our Akuma reels where our, our side plate on the left-hand side flips down, this one's gonna flip up. So we're gonna flip it up, give it a little jiggle, and it's gonna expose our braking system. Now, right here, you have zero to six, like the majority of our, our bait casting outfits. And what I like to do is grab my, my fingernail and make it, you'll hear it click, one rotation, two. I normally set it on one or two, depending on how much wind, you know, today we don't have a lot of wind out here, um, and, and so normally I'll start with one, and if one's not enough, I'll, I'll go to two. If we get a little bit of wind, I'm trying to cast those big baits in the wind, but normally you won't need any more than that. Grab your side plate. Push it back down the reel, make sure it's nice and secure. Make a couple rotations. on the screw, and now you're good to go. Now this is the 350 size, but also addition for this year is the big 450 for your big giant swim bait. You know, it's gonna be a lot of fun getting out there on the boat this spring and throwing these big reels for those big bass. Hopefully you guys check these reels out at akumafishing.com or in a retailer new year.